Hey what's up guys, Case Kiral here and this is Yamaha A1 and this is it and it's running an Android Oreo. Finally, Android Oreo has arrived to Yamaha A1 but not for all. If you have registered for the beta program, you will probably gonna get an Android Oreo on Yamaha A1. Xiaomi has released the Android Oreo beta for Yamaha A1 beta testers. So anyway, I'm gonna show you some of its changes but first thing first, let me go to the settings, inside the settings about phone. Boom, as you can see, it's running on Android 8.0 and you can see the Android Easter egg and uh, you can tap on the Easter egg a couple of times to get the octopus. Uh, Android Oreo brings some of the few changes uh, where the NuGet, uh, like picture in picture, autofill passwords, notification dots and more. So I'm gonna show you some of the features. I'm not gonna be cover all of the features, probably gonna cover in another video. So there is nothing changed in terms of the uh, Android Oreo on Mi A1. The same, uh, you can get the same launcher. The only thing that you will notice in Android Oreo is the speed of the fingerprint. It unlocks very fast without any delay if you compare with the NuGet. It's very instant and very fast. And also you will notice the uh, notification center. The notification center is completely revamped. As you can see, it's everything is in the black and white combination. If you notice the two goals, the two goals are the grayish and sort of the black, which is a very, very neat looking. And I really love this notification center. I'm playing with it all the time. And if you notice the settings gear icon has been moved from the top to the bottom, you can simply swipe one time and then you will be able to access settings. So you can quickly jump right into it. So very easily and very fast. And I notice one thing in settings, if I tap on the build number as seven times, it's asking me to confirm the pin. That means in Android Oreo, you need to type the password or PIN, which is used to unlock your phone. And if I go back to the main page of the uh, settings page, and here inside the sound, you're gonna see the new option called headphones and audio effect. Here, you will be able to customize your headphones to get the good quality of sound of your headphones. So very, very neat, and I really like this. And I need to test this feature. And uh, yeah, as you can see, the settings is also redesigned completely. Everything is on a black and white combination, which is pretty dope. And uh, yeah, and uh, notification dots are also there. Basically, whenever you get a notification, your icons uh, will highlight within the badges, which is a pretty good thing. I'm gonna show you all of these features in my upcoming video of Android Oreo. So, but for now, it's a quick overview of Android Oreo and Mi A1. I forgot to mention that a picture in picture of Android Oreo. So this is the uh, main feature of Android Oreo. So picture in picture allows you to play a video uh, across the screen. You can move that video and you can access, you can watch the video and you can do another task. Very neat and good thing. The picture in picture currently works with YouTube, Chrome and Google Duo and some of the applications. So probably developers can take an advantage of the picture in picture in the upcoming day. So that's pretty much it. And uh, that's the uh, quick overview of Android Oreo running on the Mi A1. If you want me to make a tutorial on how to install Android Oreo beta on Mi A1, do let me know in the comment section down below. I will, I will be appreciated. And also, thank you so much for watching this video. I will catch you in my next one. Until then, bye-bye now.